Just the facts. Burqa is an Arabic word that dates back to the 1800s. It's an article of clothing that covers someone's face and body. Burqas are often associated with Islam, as they're worn by some Muslim women. In France, it's illegal to wear a burqa, according to a new law that went into effect this week. Two women who were protesting the ban were arrested on Monday. Police say they weren't arrested for wearing burqas, but rather for being part of an unauthorized protest. French officials say burqas pose a security concern and affect the dignity of the women who wear them. But critics of the ban say it violates European human rights laws. Atika Schubert is in France. She has more on this new law and the reaction to it. Well, a highly controversial law has gone into effect, and it's the talk of the country, as you can imagine. In fact, I'm going to hold up just a section of Le Parisien newspaper here. The headline is, The Full Veil is Banned on the Road. It actually has a small diagram here to show exactly what is allowed and what is not allowed in France now. Uh, the burqa, which covers the entire face, is banned. The niqab, which covers everything but the eyes, is also banned. But the hijab, which covers the head but leaves the face unveiled, is allowed. Now, the nuts and bolts of this law, basically, uh, it is now illegal uh, for anyone to wear a full veil covering uh, on the streets of France in public. And in public, it means anywhere on the streets, in a public office, such as a post office or a train station, uh, even in a cinema, it is not allowed. Really, the only place where the full veil is allowed is in a car, the private vehicle, uh, or in the privacy of your own home. There are only an estimated uh, less than 2,000 women in France that actually wear the full veil, so it won't impact that many people. Uh, but it is highly controversial. Now, CNN did have the opportunity to speak to one woman who is wearing the full veil and says she will continue to wear the full veil even as this law goes into effect. And she told us what she thinks of this new face of France. In all honesty, I'm just sad. I'm just sad and disappointed. Because quite frankly, to get to this point, I think it's very revealing about many things. And thankfully, thankfully, not all of the French population think like the politicians who voted this law. Now, even though this only affects a small portion of women here in France, this law is very popular. It was passed with an overwhelming majority in France's parliament. And in the most latest polls, more than 80% of French respondents say they support the law. Atika Schubert, CNN, Paris.